Thank you to all my subscribers on my YouTube channel, Arriba La Vida. And if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Subscribe now! Saludos to the Bay Area. My friend, he sent me a track because he's actually been managing someone. And not only that, but he's been writing a lot of music and all these bandas have been recording his music, which little did I know. I mean, I know he was doing videos. But it's so cute because I haven't talked to him in so many years. I haven't seen him in so long. And little do you know, like, people are watching you. People are following you. Like, he knows I've been doing music. And he thought about me for some of the songs that his artist is doing. And he sent me these two tracks. And I automatically loved the first one. Like, I got too excited. I started writing to it. And then I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. We figured out all the details and I'm super excited. Okay, so it's kind of weird because he sent me the song. I was writing my verse, which totally a different vibe of everything I written from Chambalera and from Pegao. I totally was challenged to like do a whole different kind of flow, really demonstrate do I have cadence. And I felt very confident when I was writing it. I was loving my flow. And now that I've been listening to it, that they approved it, and I'm ready to go to the studio to drop my verse, I'm like, I don't really like it. It's because, like, it's singing. It's more like a reggaeton flow vibe. And I'm really singing. And I guess I'm feeling a little, like, insecure because you guys know my thing is more like rap, like flow. That I really feel like that's my thing. And when I'm really singing it out, I kind of get like, maybe I can sing it. <laughs> So definitely need to practice it and I have to feel like 100% confident. And I know maybe right now I was just like tired. It was a long day. I did a lot of things. So maybe I just need to, you know, leave it alone and go back to it later, which is actually not something that I'm used to because I'm used to like writing my songs like this and like dropping them like this, especially in studio, like boom, I don't waste time. But I guess I'm going through a whole new experience and it's good. It's good. You know, to be tested and go through new situations. Not all the time am I going to feel 100% comfortable with what I write. Plus, I have time. I don't have to, like, do it now and have it now. I have a little bit of time, but ahí les encargo este nuevo tema. It's going to be titled Arriba y Abajo. And the artist, it's a foursome. Miss Lala, Sergio Rivers, Roy Guerra, and James the Spitta. Les encargo eso. Vamos a estar grabando mi parte del video para el video musical. We're going to be recording that November 5th, 6th, and 7th in Las Vegas. Go Canelo, because it's a Canelo fight too. Super excited, super stoked. Amazing project, amazing collaboration. I'm working with these people from the Bay. I'm going to do my own thing over here, send them my tracks so they can put them in the song and mix and master. Amazing, amazing that people are watching me. That's why I got to keep hustling. I got to keep dropping music and doing me because little do I know people are watching and people want to collaborate people that are willing and wanting to do things right I am so so blessed that coming soon and then I'm waiting for a contract on another beat Miss Lala can do another single and also No Soy Humilde is in studio so I'm waiting for all the arreglos for the banda and to go drop that as well. Miss Lala's coming with music. It's taking a little bit of time, but I'm coming, mi gente, I'm coming. Chambalera is not all I got, I promise you. All right, keep following. Subscribe, comment, let me know what you think. Arriba la vida, love you. Mi gente, Sígueme en todas mis redes sociales, en el Facebook, Instagram y Snapchat como Lalas VIP. Y claro, en mi canal de YouTube, Arriba la Vida.